We've long heard about robots that would be coming into the home and helping us with everyday tasks, but it seemed long into the future. Tell me a joke. Okay, seriously. Why did the robot cross the road? Because it was programmed by the chicken. We're here to see some advances in robots that walk, talk, and maybe convince us that that future isn't so far away. This robot from Toyota is actually playing the trumpet with its fingers. And it's doing the blowing too. Some also do a good job of looking like humans. The Osimo from Honda is the product of 20 years work. The, the company's been investing in research and development since 1986, and we've gotten the technology to the point that you see here. Like proud parents, its engineers were thrilled when the robot could walk. And even more so when it could climb stairs, and then when it could kick a ball. Simple task for a human toddler, but tough for a robot. This year's developmental milestone? Osimo can run. Not like the wind, but it's a big deal because the robot, like humans, becomes briefly airborne between steps. Honda and Toyota say they see robots becoming a big business and that they could be ready to come home with us within a decade. Mitsubishi already sells this one in Japan. It works as a greeter at hospitals and accompanies patients to their destination. Can I help you? <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. This seal is sold to hospitals and nursing homes for soothing patients. Humanoid robots aren't just toys to the Japanese automakers. We see big applications in healthcare. Um, again, robot could do a heavy lifting, so a nurse or an orderly who has to move a patient around, uh, you know, they no longer would have that back strain. They argue that to function in our homes, robots will need to look and move like us. They're getting close. An even bigger step, though, is getting robots to think like us. The companies are now pouring money into artificial intelligence. It's nice to meet you, David. I'm excited to be on U.S. News and World Report's website. For more on this and other tech, check out my blog. Dave's download at U.S. News and World Report. This is David Legess.